Previously on Minecraft Story Mode. Everything in the universe starts out as just a block. What comes of those blocks is up to those who wield them. And in every block there lies the potential to create or destroy. Our friends have traveled far and wide in search of the Order of the Stone. And a way to stop the Wither Storm for good. But even well-laid plans can go awry. The strong can grow weak. and beloved heroes can fall. And though some glimmer of hope may remain, a threat to this world, to its very existence, is far from over. isn't dead yet, not even close. The what now? Who are you? Jesse, Jesse, where are you? Say something, Jesse! We're coming! No way, no way! You found Gabriel? Who's Gabriel? We need to get out of here now! This way! Gabriel? Did you say Gabriel? Look out! Those Endermen are running the wrong way! They'll be killed! Soren? I can't stand by and watch! Soren, what do you think you're doing? These Endermen are running directly into danger! You're putting us in danger every second you just stand there! Jesse! They're falling behind! Actually, you gotta move faster! She's too sick! This is the best we can do! They're not gonna be able to outrun it! Not on foot! We gotta find a way to move faster! But we're all gonna be caught in the tractor beam! Can we build a portal? If somebody has the right materials... We don't! I haven't seen Obsidian since the end! We'll have to use the next best thing. Everybody, get on! Hang on. I've got Petra! Then I'll take Gabriel. Hold on, this might be a bumpy ride. Come on, horses! Whatever you do, don't look back. Ah! I look. Everyone, follow me! This is the Jesse, worst ride of my life! Axel, stop backseat steering! I can't help it, I'm getting horse sick. Ah! 
It's gaining on us! No offense, but you can use a little practice. First time on a horse here! Knock me off this thing, Jesse? Sorry. I turn around to see if it's gaining, but it's all I can do to hold on. Endermen move blocks. It's what they do. Guys, come on. We gotta build a new one, like right now. Come on, faster. We need more blocks. I got some. Yeehaw! Woo! Oh, Axel, you're screaming in my ear. Sorry. We made it. We actually freaking made it. Jesse, Gabriel was saying some pretty weird stuff back on that horse. He might have wither sickness. I don't know. You never acted the way he's been acting. I'll go talk to him. Hey, how are you feeling? I, I'm afraid I don't feel much like myself at the moment. Gabriel! It really is you! Oh, I knew if anybody could outrun death, it would be you. Uh, who are you people? It's me, Eligard. Come on. Old friend, don't you recognize us? It's Soren. We've known each other for a very long time. Just give him some space for now. He may still come out of it. <sighs> what a terrible turn of events. You! You're the one who rescued me! Tell me, please, what is going on? I remember only blackness. And then, suddenly you were there! You were caught in the Witherstorm, trapped. For how long? Long enough that it did this to you. It felt like an eternity. It was dark and foul, and I was sure I was a goner. Well? You aren't. You made it back alive. Which is more than I can say for some of us. <sighs> Magnus. For a second there, I almost managed to forget. You guys talking about Magnus? I still can't believe he's gone. How? How could this have happened? To lose not just a friend, but a member of the Order of the Stone! He knew the risks, and still he let me take his armor. He was so brave. He was also incredibly stupid, but still, so brave. Ah! Being emotional is getting us nowhere! What I want to know is, what happened out there today? Why is that thing still alive? My instructions were simple. You were the one in the middle of everything. What went wrong? You tell me. Excuse me? Well, you're the one who thought we could destroy the command block with a big old bomb. So the command block is still out there? Of course it is! Oh, great! And now, to make matters worse, we've gone from one weather storm to three! Our plan was a total failure! 
I should have cast the foul thing into the abyss. So is the command block controlling all three Witherstones? Uh, why are you asking me? Am I expected to know every last thing in the universe? Uh, I need a moment to think. Is he always like this? You have no idea. That jacket! I recognize it! Lucas always wears that jacket. No. There were other people wearing that very same jacket when I was thrown from the monster! Ugh. It hurts just to think about. Just put it out of your mind. Jesse, if what Gabriel said is true... I mean, do you think? I thought for sure they were gone, but... Lucas, your friends could still be out there! I know, and that means I... I gotta go after them. They might need me, Jesse. Whoa. I suddenly feel really dizzy. Easy, easy. I gotcha. Hey, buddy. You doing okay? Of course you are. Wish I could say the same for everyone else. Gravel? No. Dirt? Don't think so. Lucas, what are you doing? I told you. I'm going after my friends. I thought the other ocelots were dead. But if they're not, I need to go find them. Look, I am grateful to you guys for bringing me this far. You can't just up and leave, Lucas. You're part of our team. And you saying that just reminds me that I left my team. But Lucas... Look, you and me, we've made a pretty good team so far. I'd even call us friends. So I hope you'll understand why I need to go help my old friends. They do it for me. But we are helping them. Saving the world saves them too. Isn't that just... kind of abstract? No, the number one thing you can do for them is to make sure we defeat those Witherstorms. I... I guess you got a point. Okay, I'll stay. I just... I just really hope they're all right. Thanks. I'm gonna go check on the horses. <coughs> Whoa, easy there, Petra. Stop fussing over me, I'm fine. Not gonna lie, but we've dealt with worse, right? Have we? How's it going? Tell me, Jesse, who is this person? She keeps insulting me. One minute I think I'm talking to a friend. That right there is Eligard. Ellie to you. Eligard, hmm? And how do I know her exactly? I sense we have a history, but... You guys defeated the Ender Dragon together, the most fearsome creature this land has ever seen. Really? Yeah, really! You're kind of a big deal. It isn't working. He doesn't remember anything. Talk to him about your past, something only you would know about. Hmm. Like what? We haven't seen each other for so long. Tell him more about the Order. Who you guys were, how you got together, anything. Well, we came together because we loved adventure. And we split apart because... It doesn't matter now. But in between, we did some amazing things together. Amazing, I tell you. We used to think we were invincible. And perhaps we were. Thank you for sharing that with me. And Jesse, thank you too. You've been a big help here. I, uh, I need to repay your kindness. I'm not sure how exactly. It's no problem. I'd have done it for anyone. All the same, you have my thanks. Now then, tell me more about this Order of the Stone. Oh, I'm not even sure where to start. Petra, how are you doing? You look terrible, Petra. Your skin is, like, almost gray. Hey, way to not sugarcoat it. I feel even worse than I look. Man, if it wasn't for Ivor, she wouldn't even be like this. Ah, uh, no kidding. That's not exactly true. Ivor built the Wither, sure, but he couldn't have done it without that skull I gave him. 
If I'd just taken a second to think about it. This isn't all on you, and you know it. I was in on the deal, too. But I brought that skull back solo. I was Ivor's henchman. Well, I was your henchman. So, based on the transitive property of henchmen. Just know, I'm gonna do everything I can to make this right. Petra, I know this isn't easy to hear, but you're too sick to be going anywhere. I'm not that sick. Maybe you should rest in this cave for a while. I mean, it's safe, defensible. If I say I'm fine, then I'm <coughs> fine. If you try to keep going, I'm afraid you're not gonna make it. Petra, you need to keep fighting. There's no time to sit around relaxing in some cave. Jesse. Thanks, Jesse. Knew you'd understand. Just give me a little time to catch my breath, and I'll be fine. This is a bad idea, Jesse. Yeah, well, it's Petra's call to make. <laughs> Sorry, Ruben. I don't really feel like company. <laughs> Ruben! Oh, not again. Ruben! Don't run off on me like that, okay? I don't want to lose you, you understand? <laughs> yeah, I know you've run off before, but things are different now. We've lost too many people already. The world needs us, Reuben. So much of it has already been reduced to bedrock, and it's up to us to save the rest of it. <laughs> well, maybe that is a lot of pressure for just a person and a pig, but we have to find a way. over cobblestone might come in handy. How are the horses looking? Tired, but they're okay. Same as the rest of us. Well, I'm glad you're staying with us, Lucas. Yeah. Me too. There are three of those things now. You say that like it's my fault. It is your fault. Oh, take responsibility for once, Soren. I did that by locking the command block away. So only you could use it. God. Oh. Soren, you need to listen to me. Oh, what good has ever come of that? What are you doing here, Ivor? Come to lock me in another room? I came to offer my help. Ha! He's been following us. It's not like that. You need to hear me out. What you don't understand is, you are all in very grave danger. <laughs> Obviously! No, I mean specifically this group. The Witherstorm isn't acting randomly. It's following Gabriel. Gabriel? You see, I may have programmed it to follow his amulet. You mean the Order's amulet? Yes, Soren. That amulet. And the reason you didn't tell us that ages ago? Gabriel was gone. I didn't think it mattered. Right, except Gabriel gave the amulet to me. What? I... I didn't know. Ugh, Ivor, you fool. You've created a monster that's following Jesse, and it's only getting stronger. You don't think I realize that? Nothing can stop those things. Nothing even hurts them. Well, except Enderman. Enderman? 
Jesse's right. The Withers' gaze passed over them, and they went wild. We actually just saw a bunch of Endermen pull blocks off a Witherstorm. So... So, enough of them working together might be able to destroy a Witherstorm entirely. It's a promising concept, at least in theory. Is that even possible? Yes. Yes, I, I think it might be. We'd simply need to get a large group of them into the storm's vicinity. In fact, there's probably more than enough of them still in my fortress. An unintended side effect of you flooding the end. This is just like the old days, Soren. You and your crazy ideas- Hush, Ivor, for once! Ugh. Question is, how to bring the storms and the Endermen together? Endermen aren't pets. They don't follow orders. At least, not from mere mortals. Isn't it obvious? The fortress is the key! If we can't bring the Endermen to the Witherstorms, we bring the Witherstorms to the Endermen. Just one problem. You're forgetting about the command block! Ugh, oh, yes. It's clear now that no weapon can destroy it. Not even a Formidabomb. Actually, I may have a solution to that. You see, when I first took possession of the command block... You mean, stole it? Yes, well, I created a failsafe. A backup plan, for just in case. What kind of failsafe, exactly? An enchanting book. One that contains the power of the command block itself. Use it to enchant a weapon, and you'll be able to smash the command block to bits. Forever! Yes. Yes, that's it! It could very well solve all our problems. What are we waiting for? Let's go get that book! Just one problem. It's at my secret lab, which is sort of far away. How far could it possibly be? Let's just say it's the farthest place a person can travel before being utterly... Oh dear, what was that? Us so quickly. We're not safe anywhere, are we? Well, we can't stand around and wait for it. We need to get out of here right now. Ivor says that if we don't, that thing will. Ivor? Well, I'll be. It is you. A pleasure, as always, Eligard. Hello, my name is Gabriel. Somebody pinch me. Anyway, Ivor's figured out that Witherstorms are drawn to the amulet. We're gonna lure them back to Soren's fortress and destroy the command block with an enchanted super weapon. You figured all that out just now? The point is we need to get moving. We aren't safe. Not as long as we have that amulet. I'll take it. You can't. I can, and I have to. Axel, are you sure? Of course not. But you'll have three Witherstorms chasing you wherever you go! Yeah, if things get too intense, I'll duck into the nether or something. I'm tired of always being the selfish one. You just go make that super weapon. I'll meet you back at Soren's fortress. Well, Axel shouldn't have to do this alone. I'm going with him. I appreciate that. Jesse, I'm going with him too. Like you said, I need to keep fighting. Well, I'm going with Jesse. I, I pledge to help, and that's what I must do. My friends are still out there somewhere. And you must do this for them. Guys, we need to go now. Hey, Jesse. Let's try our handshake again, just once for the road. The warrior's whip? You got it. <laughs> I'll see you at Soren's, all right? Not if I see you first.
Are we there yet? Almost there. everyone onward that's really not necessary I'm just trying to be encouraging Profoundly sore. Huh. I feel like we've been riding forever. I am telling you, we cannot go to the Far Lands. They're not just the edge of our world, but the limits of our comprehension. Oh, please. The Far Lands are a happy accident. Nature's way of keeping life interesting. No, no, no. They are perilous and unpredictable. Perlin noise, floating points. These are not matters to be toyed with. You know, I think I've heard of the Far Lands before. I'd be surprised if you hadn't. The far lands lie at the very edge of all things, where logic gives way to chaos. They're a dangerous place to visit, and a ridiculous place to construct a laboratory. <laughs> Just wait until you see it. Do those two never stop arguing? I don't know. I'm too hungry to care. Yeah, I'm starving. We all are. Maybe we should turn back? This isn't the time. Swamps are too dangerous. You never know what might be lurking around. What was that? My stomach. Guys, we can't turn back now, not after coming so far. Fine, but I'm taking a break. So am I. We mustn't linger long. The Far Lands are just beyond this swamp. So this could be our last chance to find food? <laughs> you're coming with me. It's not much, but it'll help. Like they say, two potatoes is better than one. I think they say that. Hey, Jesse, have you found any food? I should probably take what I have back to the group.
Check out what I found. A potato. Incredible. Hey, at least it's food. Potato number two coming your way. Can I have this one? Oh, you had the last one. Oh, yeah. You take it, Ivor. I'm Sorin, not Ivor. Right, of course you are. Hey, you guys want to help me look? Probably best if we stay with the horses. Witches hate trespassers. Besides, there are plenty of potatoes around. Is that a witch? Jesse, we shouldn't be here. Witches are very strong. Let's get out of here. Good idea. <laughs> Guys! Jesse, did you find any more food? No, well, sort of, but it doesn't matter. There's a witch nearby. We saw her creeping through the swamp. She's here! <laughs> oh no, you don't. Watch out for her potions. Uh -huh. See you later, you nasty old thing. <gasps> oh no, skeletons! Witches and skeletons? That's a really bad combination. You're right. Her potions combined with their arrows? Oh, we'll all be killed. Everyone, this could be a really nasty fight. The rest of you, go! Hold them off! What? Ivor, no! There's no time to argue. Just head for the corner of the glitch wall! The what wall? Hey, you witch! You're not the only one who can throw a potion! <laughs> <laughs> 